In this video, I'll show you how to initiate a conference call using the Voice over IP 7975 Cisco set. One of the first things to note is there is no conference button on the telephone set unless you have an active call on your line. Now this is true for the conference button, for the transfer button, and even the hold button. You have to have an active call on your line before you're going to see these. And right now I have an active call on the line. The blue buttons across the bottom of the screen are what we call soft keys because they're going to change and do different things depending upon what you're doing. So what's in blue is what you can do. To conference a call, it's a three-step process. You hit the conference button, dial the number you want, and then hit conference again. So let's go ahead and do that. I have an active call on the line right now, so we're going to hit the more soft key, and then press conference. The call is automatically going to be put on hold. Dial the extension or nine and the ten-digit number. Now, if your party doesn't answer, you can press your extension to return back to the original call. Hey Jim, we're ready to start our conference call. So we've announced the call, and then we hit conference again, and then all three will be joined together. So now we're on a conference call. So you can repeat this procedure to bring in up to six people on your conference. Now you can view a list of all the multiple people that are on your conference call. You hit more and then conference list. So here's the list of everyone that's on the conference call. You can remove someone from the conference call by either using the navigation key to select the party you intend to drop or just touch the screen. For more information, contact IT support at 305 284 6565.